Okay, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. We are nearing the end of our theorems. We have theorem number 20 being the angle formed by the tangent and the chord through the point of contact is congruent to the angle in the alternate segment. So firstly, let's try to picture our given being a figure that will have a segment, a chord and a segment. So a chord divides a circle into two segments, the major segment 2 and minor segment 1. Okay. So it is said here that um, if you would have a tangent line okay, with the chord, tangent line with the chord, ito yung chord natin and this is the tangent line, you will create an angle. Okay? And this angle daw, this angle theta is congruent to the angle that is on the alternate of the given segment. Remember, in this angle here, it's on this minor segment 1, right? Meaning, this angle here on minor segment 1 that is created from the chord and our tangent line here is congruent to the angle on the opposite segment. And any opposite segment? The opposite segment is the one in segment 2 or the major segment. So, what is that angle? That angle is actually an inscribed angle. Okay? This would be our inscribed angle. Okay? Or maybe let's do it the other way around. Let's do on do it on a on, on a GeoGebra. Okay? So, let's delete this um, line first. Okay, and let's just delete this line. Okay? Say that we will have our um, segment here. Okay? And if you have this segment, you will have, of course, the major segment, this is uh, here on this part, and then the minor segment, the small one. And of course, you can have an angle there. Pwede ka magkaroon ng angle. Here, here, and here, and here. Let's uh, find the measure of that angle. Okay, the angle here, here. Okay, yan. So even if or wherever I will take this one, it would still be 44.58. Okay, so there would only be one measurement of one an inscribed angle on our given seg major segment, okay? So, ang sabi daw dito, if I would have this given angle, okay, and I will have a tangent to the circle on the given chord, yan, ito yung tangent to the chord, chord CB, and then we have this line. Ang sabi daw dyan, the measure of this angle, sorry, the measure of this angle, or let's just, let's just create a chord here, a segment here. The measure of this angle that is on this minor segment is equal to the measure of the angle in the major segment or the opposite segment. Okay? So, let's have that. We will have the measure of that angle being the segment E and N. The angle is 44.58. So, you will notice it's the same. In the same concept, let's try to delete. I, I, I hope you got that. Ah. Kapag may angle ka dito sa minor segment, it's the same as the angle in the major segment. So, let's have that the other way around. Let's delete this one. And let's delete this line. Oh, sorry. Let's create it on the other part. So, let's have a line segment here. Yeah, on this given line. Okay? And then, let's have a line segment also here on the minor segment. Okay? So, let's find the measure of the angles. And here also. Yan. So, you will notice they are the same. Kasi this one, the minor segment will have 153.42 degrees. Now, this angle formed by the chord and the tangent on the major segment would be the same as that. 135.42. Okay? And what would be the use of this one? Kung sakali, if by any chance you don't know this one, but your figure falls under theorem number 20 being... You have an inscribed angle, a segment, and a tangent. Then definitely, the opposite angles, one on the minor, one on the major, or one on the major and one on the minor, they would be congruent. Okay? So that would be it for theorem number 20. I hope that you got that. Even if you will change this one. And, and let's take a look at the measure of the angle. Sorry, yeah, not that here and here. You will notice it would be the same all throughout. Okay, so I hope that you got that. Thank you everyone for listening again. If you have any other questions, you can 
um, view the video again or chat me in our class. And yan, uh, thank you. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.